and welcome back to Cooking with Katie. I'm a registered dietitian with Boyd Earth Public Health and I have Gail back here cooking again with me today. Hi, I'm Gail and I work with Boyd Earth Public Health. Today we are going to be making a fresh vitamin C rich spinach salad with a poppy seed dressing. Oh, I made you say a mouthful there. You did. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, we're in the dead of winter. This is a great salad year round. It's definitely staples you can find in the produce section all year and we all could use a little color, especially now with some fresh fruits and vegetables. I agree. Let's get started. We're going to start by putting together our poppy seed dressing, which is a quick one to put together. So in our bowl here, we have two tablespoons of some honey, and then we're gonna go ahead and add two tablespoons of white vinegar. And then we have one tablespoon of yellow mustard. Before I add that, I'm gonna grab a little spoon here to scoop it out. I didn't mean to grab the child spoon, but <laughs> that's what I got. I like spatulas. That probably would have done a better job. I'll do that in a minute. And then we have two tablespoons of finely chopped onion. It's not super chopped, but you can do it however you would like. And it looks like maybe a little more than a tablespoon. And we are making the full serving of the dressing. So we'll have extra. And then the last thing is two teaspoons of poppy seed and a fourth a teaspoon of salt. So we'll let Gail whisk that up a little bit. And then the last touch, I'm gonna throw a little bit more of this mustard in. Once we get it really well whisked together, and you could actually do this like in a, I was just talking with Gail before we started, like in a bottle, a shaker bottle sometimes works better. So whichever works, best for you. So once you have it good and combined to your liking, the last step is just a third of a cup of olive oil. Now we're going to put our salad together. We have four cups of mixed leafy greens and we are going to add a quarter cup of chopped carrots with orange peppers. You can use any type of pepper that you want. And I'm not gonna put it all just because I'm not quite sure we have quite four cups of spinach here, but just make it to your liking. And we have some radishes, but any choice of additional vegetables works. There we go. And however much of what you like on there. I would dump everything. I know, right? What's the point? <laughs> it's What's already the... chopped. I know, what are you right? gonna do with This it? is true, this is true. Um, and then to add that little burst of, besides what we have with the peppers and the spinach of our vitamin C in there, um, we're gonna top with a few mandarin oranges. I, um, if you're making a bigger salad, it calls for one cup, but I'm gonna, I probably could just, this is like a, just one of those single serving half cups. So I think I will just sprinkle it all in. Um, besides the mandarin oranges, you could also do strawberries, mangoes, oranges, um, grapefruit, wonderful, lots of different topping ideas to put on there. Um, you could do some nuts cranberries, raisins, cheese, but look how colorful that game became very quickly. Now, um, you could also top with some protein to make it more of an entree, whether you wanna do some chicken breasts, canned chicken, salmon, canned ta tuna, excuse me, or beans is easy to sprinkle on, or just cutting up an egg. So you know the versatility of this salad really can build quickly, so just make it how you'd like it. Our salad is complete. When making this salad, you can prep the salad and dressing ahead but you'll want to wait until serving to dress it. And that's what we did too. So this serving, like I just showed you, this is probably like to serve two to four people, kind of depending on how you're using it. Like we said, um, if you're gonna serve it like a dinner salad, a side salad or an entree, um, but make it how you need it. Like, like Gail had mentioned, you probably don't wanna dress over, you know, to get wilty and things like that. Remember the dressing too will store up into the fridge for um, up to two weeks. So you get some life out of this salad. Awesome. Thanks for watching and we hope you enjoyed our quick salad ideas. Remember to check out whiteearth.com for today's recipes along with more. See you, See you next time. time.